Chicago baseball from beautiful Wrigley Field. Tonight the opener of a three game series between the Minnesota Twins and the Chicago Cubs. Jay Mack looks to push his all time hit streak record to even greater heights. Next. Ball four takes the base. And now here is Jay Mack Matty already Burke. holding the all time right history field. record. He continues Yay. to carve out his place Matt. in the game's pantheon right here. You know Matty whatever happens in this guy's career regardless whether he becomes a superstar for 15 years or fizzles away count. this mark will always yeah. stand. Yeah. It will always be something that other players chase. Children will yeah. learn about it in textbooks. This guy has certainly etched his place in this game's history. Good. No ball, two oh, right. two now. While his hitting streak might be drawing most of the attention, some might not realize he's hitting for real power as well. Slugging over 500. For and now, meanwhile, this is going to be extra bases, and that may just get a couple of runners home. And he will add yet another game to his incredible hitting streak as it now reaches even further into the stratosphere. You know, Dero, I don't know if this thing's ever going to end. This guy's been raking now for almost two months, and he's swinging the bat just as good now as when this streak started to start it off with his first base hit. Yeah, it, do, it doesn't seem like he's coming out of it anytime soon. I wonder the pitcher Trevor. that would create such a tough matchup for this guy to shut him down because he's playing with the big part of the field. He can beat you in so many different ways, and this number's getting just straight ridiculous. Here comes the one two. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Well, I have to give credit to him on the mound for not letting that previous pitch get him. He wanted it, but he didn't that get the call. But I the love how he didn't let it affect him. He comes right back with another good pitch and gets the punch out. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one, two. Sent on the ground back to second. Only play is going to be to first, so score it as an RBI ground out as the lead moves to two to nothing now. That grounder was hard hit, and sometimes the runner at third will have to hold on a ball like that, but he was off on contact, and they opted to that take the good. out at first instead. The third baseman. Gerald. Now at the plate, Gerald Tyler. Tyler. And now the Twins look to plate more in the opening frame. The one-two. This one's down to third. Right to him. Throw is in time, and they're able to avoid the huge inning here as the side is retired. So it's two runs on two hits, no errors, and a runner left. We'll move on to the bottom half of inning number one. Twins are out in front, two to nothing. Now it'll be Jay now Mack, back. runner in White scoring field. position with two guys. Mack. From the belt, the pitch, grounder down the line at third. Get your pitch, huh? Ready with the 0-1. Hit hard on the ground to short. Come on, get Scooped out, get out, get out! Throw on to first, yeah. gets him, and the side is retired. Striding in is Batting Solomon eight. Silk, the who's all over the place. Solomon. Two on, two out, and of course, Silk. here in inning number two. Looking to wiggle out of this, here it is. This one's flared off to the right go, side. Flores over to his left, and that retires the side. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and two men left on. We play two full. It's the Twins four and the Cubs nothing. And now in the box, Alexander Vizcaino as we move on to the bottom of inning number the three. Pitcher. They've gotten Alex a gut punch Hunter. to start this game. There's no Vizcaino. doubt about this, but that's when you have to turn the scoreboards off. Everybody do their job one at bat at a time. The one two. Late on the fastball there as this one skied out toward right. Mack is over a few steps as he puts it away for the first out. So two are gone now and the Cubs half the of the third. And the that will bring up Cole Tucker. Cole Tucker. Pulled high in the air out to right field. 
Mack gets under it and makes the catch to end the inning. Three up, three down for the Cubs. They trail here four to nothing. Stepping up is now Jay Mack. Right One for two with a double on Jay. his line thus far. Mack. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Oh, this ball is hammered to deep center field. Into the bleachers and gone. Two run shot to straight away center. 45 home runs now on the campaign as they pile on. It's now six to nothing. Wow, talk about a guy getting hot, right? Hits a bomb, hit one yesterday. Usually when he gets hot, he starts to hit them in bunches. And this could be the beginning of a very, very good hot streak. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And up well, next, up. Nico Horner. The second baseman. Nico Horner. Swing and a blooper to the right side. Mack is in a few steps as he takes it for the first down. Ready to take his hats again. Right Jay field. Mack lasted Yay. a two run homer in his Mack. last at bat. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And that's by him. It's 0 1. 1. Hey, this pitcher better be careful better right here. Fly. My man at the plate is not trying to push something to the opposite field. 1 and 1. Oh, left out. Six runs, eight hits, and no errors in the ballgame for Minnesota. Hey, here we go. Swing, and there it goes. He got all of that ball. Into the bleachers and out of here. So a two run shot to left center, his second home run of the game, as they've widened this lead to eight now. Second home run of the game right there. He is locked in at the plate. You hear so many of today's players talk about rhythm and timing. Well, he is perfectly on time in the heart of the zone. So now here is yeah, Anderson man. Tejeda singled in his last at bat. Anderson. One out, nobody on. Flare out toward right center. Flores is calling for it, and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Ready to take his hacks again. Jay Mack blasted a two run homer in his last at bat. Oh, man, he's making a lot of noise in this one. He's feeling really locked in at the plate right now. We used to have a saying in the dugout anybody could get two. There ain't too many guys hitting north of two bombs in the game in the big leagues. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Still only one out in the inning. Hey, dripping and ripping, kid. Let's go. And he goes down and gets this fastball and takes it high in the air to deep straightaway center. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Wow, what a week for these guys. Talk about firing on all cylinders. Winners of an amazing seven games in a row. They say to never question the streak, and these guys aren't. They're just enjoying this ride. Ten to one, the final lopsided score in this ball game. Minnesota jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Rumsey Contreras gets to double.